Back with Wendell Clark for the breakaway. And Wendell, uh, here's your first secret. Go ahead. The first secret is, is, is think puck. You're thinking through the eyes of the puck. Because if I'm in a situation, body off the post, I see this half of the net. I can't see the other half of the net very well. But if I look through the eyes of the puck and think where the puck's coming from, the other side of the net is just as open or more open than this side because you're thinking through the eyes of the puck. It's in a different angle than I am. So what I might be thinking is open isn't from this angle. Now, there is a difference between a breakaway and a shootout, obviously. No pressure uh, in terms of a back checker on the shootout, but what do you do? Well, I think if you're, you're starting from center ice, and, and the key is to have a comfortable speed. And there's never always one right, but you always, I think, want to go off center to try to have the goalie maybe miss, miss his angle. If you go straight in, the goalie's got a perfect angle. You don't make him work. But if you go off and then come back to the middle, you might find the goalie loses his position a little bit and gives you a chance to shoot. You always want to maybe try to get back to your perfect shooting position, body on the post, puck in the middle, but he may open up from there. And with speed, it's not really slow, it's not really fast, because it's tough to handle a puck going too fast, but going too slow, it's easier for the goalie to pick up your tempo. Uh, I think a lot of the rule of thumb is, if the, goalies, if the heel of the goalie's skates are still at the top of the crease in the breakaway, you're not going to have much to shoot at. So your odds are you're going to deke. If his feet are close to being in the crease, you're going to have something to shoot at because he's lost some of his angle. And that's the whole idea about changing angle, maybe changing your speed, but coming with enough speed to force him to think a little bit as he's back in his net. So you need your head up for that read. And what about uh, puck at your side, puck out in front? You always say that gives away the deke when it's out in front of you. But Well, I think if you, you, you carry the puck straight at the goalie. Probably Rocker Richard, one of the old-time guys, carry the best straight out in front of you. You're not giving anything away. If the puck is sitting flat on your stick in front, you're not bringing the puck back, but everything sits here. You can still go everywhere on the net and shoot the puck, but he can't tell where you're going. You're looking at everything with your peripheral vision. Your puck sees everything, but you're not giving anything away because you're staying square to the net. Here it is for all the marbles. Wendell Clark, Mano a Mano. even a goal. shot on that. Good save. CBC.ca slash Think Hockey for more.